subs. I appreciate it. So I bought this thing. This thing. It's a... Where did I put it? It's a wireless uh, adapter that lets you use uh, your PS4 controller with your PC or Mac, right? I plugged it in, I watched three fucking YouTube videos about it, and I could not figure out how to get this piece of shit to work, right? So I unplugged it, right? I unplugged it. And then I looked into uh, Steam has this new beta support for... Uh, for uh, whatever the hell it is, right? See, this guy right here says DS4 Windows. He thinks he knows what he's talking about. Buckle your seatbelt, motherfucker. So Steam now natively has support for the DualShock 4 controller, right? So that's if you plug it in with the cable. What you do is you go to big picture mode with Steam, you go to controllers, and it will detect it, right? Now, what I did is, I grabbed a USB Bluetooth dongle that I had sitting around, right? I plugged that shit into the fucking computer, and I went to Bluetooth devices, activated it, I paired this with it. The way you pair a controller is, first it has to be completely unpaired with everything else, then you have to hold down the share and the home button for a while, until this shit starts flashing like crazy, when you do that, you pair this motherfucker together, and the bottom line is, this is, I think, wirelessly connected to my PC now. So, moral of the story is, this thing is a piece of shit, and it doesn't even need to exist, because Steam already handled it themselves. All you need is a Bluetooth dongle that works, you know? Uh... I'm, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see how it works. It's supposed to be connected right now. I got to push the button because it's not on, right? So now it's on. I think. That's not the color I want it to be. Oh, shit. It's working. Looky, look what we have here. It's working. It's alive. Can you believe that? Wirelessly connected with my PS4 controller to my computer without any kind of DS, four windows, none of it. No motion joy, no nothing. Eastside Eli. Monica's and Ma. Hey, thanks very much. How's it going, Eastside Eli? Thanks. I don't know. I'm pretty impressed. This is something that I've wanted for a while. And it kind of seemed hard to obtain. Uh, but, well, I mean, not hard. Yeah, hard to obtain. Complicated. Why is this guy wearing one shoe? What the fuck is this? Hobo. <laughs> one shoe? Is that like a tactical move? Why is he wearing one shoe? I never heard of that shit. I've never worn this loincloth. This guy's wearing one shoe. Weird. Tactical one shoe decision. I don't know. Uh, mm. How is the input delay with the Bluetooth? Man, that's an interesting question. It's hard to tell without a fighting game, but... I think it's acceptable for a non-fighting game. I'm playing on a TV that I bought from research through DisplayLag.com, so it's a, it's a relatively solid TV for gaming. Um, it feels good enough. I don't know. Feels good enough. This dongle that I bought, I bought it years ago. It's so funny that it worked, because for years I have had no use for it because it didn't work when I first bought it, but I kept it. The reason I bought this specific dongle is because it was recommended for good latency for gaming. So I did this research a long time ago and I never ended up, uh, you know, getting it to work. So it didn't even matter. But now that Steam has officially released support for it, it's fucking sweet.